That's one thing you can't control is another person's opinion. No matter how much you want to, no matter how much you feel like swaying a person, it's best to just walk away. I don't even, I don't think these things, but I preach them. Here's the thing, man, in the, in the heat of the moment, it's hard to walk away. Nobody's gonna walk away in the heat of the moment. But, you could probably train yourself. I don't know why I'm even talking. Why am I even talking? People don't wanna hear this shit. They wanna hear the music and they want raw music. They want to get hyped up from what you got to say. I feel like sometimes, man, I could be a downer. I don't always want to be a downer, man. I want to be lifelike. I want to be Oh yeah. I want to get it hype. I'm tired of being oh. Being happy made Pharrell re-famous. But are they really famous forever? Are they really famous forever? Does what they say matter? Is what they saying gonna go down in history? Like really, I think about this all the time. I have a therapy session with myself all the time. And it's because of the craft. It's because of the game, man. It's because of the game. Listeners make me think this. I can make a million songs. I can just sit there day after day. And if I don't say it the right way, if what I'm saying isn't hitting, if it's not cohesive, if it's not making sense, if I'm not writing it in the right way, if I'm not jotting down something thoughtful, something positive, if I'm not jotting down something that has got to be relevant or something about maybe it should be about my mom, maybe it should be about my parents, my dad, his issues, maybe it should be about my girlfriend, maybe it should be about me, I don't know. There's too much to write about sometimes. And it just becomes a storm in my head and I don't know what to write. Maybe that is my man, my life projected on a screen and paper. If I clean up my life and I figure shit out for myself, maybe it'll create better music. Now, but these are things I gotta ask myself because the song isn't gonna be relevant otherwise. The song's not gonna be good. The song's just not gonna hit. Yeah, sure, people will like my songs. People do like my songs and they give me props all the time. How many props are you gonna get though before you, you're like, you need to get paid? You're not just a Pied Piper. You can't just keep doing these things and wasting time in your life without getting paid for it. You're getting compensated back. You need to make some money to show that you're worth something on this planet what are you worth is it what you make is it what you're worth in the future is it what you used to be worth what are you worth and is that really what's going to make your music uh replayable replay value are you going to have a high replay value or low replay value people don't even want to listen to it are you going to be remembered even after you get worth. I write about it, I can think about it. 
Is that a song I should even do? Something about thoughts? Something about what I'm saying now? Or should it be a party joint? See how long I can get wrapped up in my fucking depression before I just finally want to write a party joint. You know? Because I could just go song after song after song and it's depressed, depressed, depressed. Party joint. Depressed, depressed, depressed. Twerk music. You know what I mean? And it's just like, it's becoming like so predictable. And um, it's almost to the point where I gotta rename the song something else so people will click on it just because I don't even want them to know what the song is about. Because they'll judge it and they won't even listen to it. So, yeah, this is my everyday process. I wake up, I go to sleep thinking about this stuff.